Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December 28th of 2022. Well, it is titled Messier 88. So what do we see here? Well, this is number 88 in Charles Messier's catalog from the 1700s, which looked at various star clusters and nebulae, and in fact, objects that appeared slightly fuzzy through the smaller telescopes of the time, but were known not to be comets. So comet hunting was very common back then, as it continues today. But when you'd notice a fuzzy object, you'd have to follow it to figure out whether it was moving quickly through the sky or relatively quickly like a planet uh, that would identify it as a comet and you could determine its orbit. There were other objects that looked fuzzy like this one that would remain in the same position relative to the stars. And those were then cataloged so that people would know looking at them, okay, that this is not a comet and we can move on to our next object. Now this is actually a spiral galaxy and in fact it is a uh, example good example of a spiral galaxy we can see the distinct spiral arms swirling out from the center and we can see the different colorations associated with star formation in the spiral arms of the galaxy the blue star blue color of massive star clusters that have recently formed as well as the pink glow of hydrogen gas excited by those hot young stars and both of those are associated with star formation and are seen prominently in the arms of spiral galaxies such as M88 here and our own Milky Way. Now we'll see that the coloration changes to more of a yellow as we move into the center where there is a lot more light from the large red stars that have reached the end of their life red giants and red supergiant stars. So we know that this again is something like our own Milky Way, just much more distant at 50 million light years away from us. However, in size, it's very similar to the size of our Milky Way about 100,000 light years. So someone off in the distance in fact, perhaps observing from this very galaxy, if there is an intelligent civilization out there looking towards us, might see our Milky Way looking much like we see Messier 88 in the sky. So it would see something very similar in size and structure to what we are seeing here today. So that was our picture of the day for December 28th of 2022. It was titled Messier 88. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.